It's time for Yasser's Film Forum. The bit where Yasser does a forum on films. Hi, Hi Ian. Um, first, I'm going to be talking about the UK box office top ten, describing each top ten. Then I'm going to be giving a few reviews, um, previews about the films that are coming out, okay? Uh, uh, UK box office top ten. At ten, it's Hum Ko De Vanaka Gaye. It's an um, kind of an Asian movie. It's a romantic film, and it's about um, a guy um, who is a one is a racing driver, uh, and the other his girlfriend is a fashion designer. And I'm going through it if you listen. And he uh, when he goes to Canada for um, testing, and he meets up with um, his the racing teams. Um, what's his um, girl and he wants to go out uh, he wants to marry her but he doesn't want to marry his girlfriend and uh, uh, the thing is will he be able to marry who he wants or will he have to stick with, with, with the one he's uh, with at nine it's <laughs> what's, love, what's funny about that at uh, nine it's the shaggy dog starring Tim Allen and Kristen Davis and uh, Tim Allen um, in the film um, spends um, He's like in the film, changing from and from a dog and back into human again, and then he's like living in a dog's life. Eight is failure to launch um, a comedy romantic film starring Matthew McConaughey and Sarah Jessica Parker. It's a film about Matthew McConaughey. Matthew McConaughey is a thirty-something slack uh, who is still at home, and he sus- he's what I suspect that like. Um, Jessica Parker, and the, uh, what are you laughing at for me? I'm doing for my film thing. If you uh, think it is, um, he's um, being girl, and he's suspecting that his parents are setting her, uh, him up with her, so so then they can get him out of the house. Um, at seven, it's Alien Autopsy, a comedy sci-fi film starring Declan Donnelly and Ant McPartlin. Um, it's a film about um, the true ba- a true story about. Um, the alien um, invasion, uh, alien thing that um, ha- um, the guy um, in the U.S. military camp, and then they have a tape of um, they get a, they buy the tape from the Americans, but they lose the tape, and then they have to um, they say that want to sell that tape to a German business guy, but then they have to fake the um, the all alien autopsy. What he says, it does. They have to fake it, and then they, they have to find out if they can um, get through. What are you laughing at me for? Ian, as six, um, it's an American haunting. It's, uh, so, uh, it's a drama horror mystery film, and it's starring Donald Sutherland, Sissy Fessick, and Rachel Hurd Wood. And it's based on a true event uh, of the only case in the U.S. history where a spirit caused the death of a man. <laughs> Ian, what are you laughing? I'm trying to do my film for. What are you laughing for? I'm going to carry on anyway. Out of five, it's uh, she's the man. It's uh, a we have Terry. Okay, at five is She's the Man. Um, it's um, a comedy rom- romance film starring Amanda Baines, Channing Tatum, and Laura Ramsey. It's, um, the film is about when her big brother decides to ditch for a couple of weeks in London. Viola Baines heads over to his elite boarding school, disguises him- herself as him, and proceeds to fall for one of her soccer teammates. Little does she realise she's not the only one with romantic troubles, as she, as he, gets in the middle of a series of intermingled love affairs. At four, it takes the lead. So, um, it's a drama music film starring Antonio Banderas, Rob Brown, after when a dance teacher, Antonio Banderas, um, teaches the um, problem uh, street kids in a deprived era how to dance um, the tango and that kind of thing, how it's a sexy dance and all that. Uh, but I don't recommend this film because it's like the, it's too much like, there's been too many films like this already, so I don't recommend you watch this film. So, at uh, three, it's, the, it's Inside Man. Um, it's a crime drama thriller film, film starring Denzel Washington, Clive Owen, and Jodie Foster. The film is about when a cop has to, um, uh, has to talk down a bankrupt but after a criminal perfect high spirals into a hostage situation it's about um, kind of an intense bank thriller so if you like the Denzel Washington uh, I think you would like this film um, at two it's scary movie four um, which is just um, 
it's, it's the last one of the four. This is the last they're going to make of the scary one, two, three, and four. Um, it's, um, it just um, carries, it carries on from the... If you've seen Scary Movie 1, 2, and 3, then I'll go and watch this film. But if you haven't watched this, then I don't think there's any point in you watching this. It just follows on from the first three and how they go and they, some of them, like, they, bad stuff happens to them and get killed and uh, uh, stuff like that. So if you've seen the first three, then you'll understand this four, then you'll know how the fourth one will go. And it stars Anthony Anderson, Craig Bierko, and Carmen Electra. And at number one, which is my favourite film, which it doesn't sort of, uh, it's quite funny, it's, uh, num at number uh, one is Ice Age 2. It's an uh, animation adventure comedy starring Ray Romano as Manny, uh, John Leguizamo as Sid, Dennis Leary as Diego, and Sean William Scott as Crash. And this, uh, this film is, is like, got, it's not got no plot in it, but it's got a lot of funny jokes where you laugh um, through the film. This film is not about the Manny or Diego. What's what he funny? Ian, why are you laughing? All right. I <laughs> what was wrong with that? Ian, what was wrong with that? Excuse me, what was wrong with that? No. Hello, what was wrong with that? I've got, I, I've got to say, yes, an excellent, excellently copied from Time Out. I didn't copy it from Time Out. But it was, a, it was a, a just a... Teeny, teeny little bit too long. Yeah, but it was better than last time. It was better, yeah. Oh, yes. It was, it was definitely better than last time. Yeah, I didn't have too much time to edit out. You know, I didn't have... Yeah. Enough... Well, the thing is... Well, it's, I it's, 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 already been, it's already been nine minutes long. We thought it was going to be like a minute and a half. No, it's nearly finished now. Uh, no, it's finished. Have you, have you seen any of the films? Um, yes, I have, yes. Which ones? I've seen um, Ice Age 2. Okay. Uh, yes, sir. Thank you. Yes. We're going to leave it there. When you do it next week, I've got an email, actually, I should read to you. Let me just read this. Okay. Uh, a couple of people saying, this is excellent. Uh, well done. Good I know it wasn't that great. No, it was but good. I, Listen, it was better than last time, okay? I, I, that, we can agree on that. Yeah, definitely. Okay, then. <laughs> okay, well, but, but there's, the, Nick and the Twickenham has emailed in. Ian, I wish to complain about Yasser's film forum. Fine. I didn't listen to Mark Commode's excellent film reviews on the Simon Mayo show because I heard Yasser was going to be on. Needless to say, I'm most disappointed. Instead of the pithy, intelligent and funny reviews I would have heard had I listened to Dr Commode, I got a badly put together mess. The UK box office countdown was a joke. Sack him now. Now, I think that's harsh, Yasser. But what I will say is when you do it next week, can we have it a little bit shorter? Um, a minute and a half. Well, how am I going to go through all the ten? Uh, well, you don't need to tell me half? every. You don't need to tell me every actor that's in it. And do you know well, what? You want me, how? Well, how do you want me to do it then? I don't know. Can you I, tell okay, me how to do it then? I will tell you how to do it. Please, sir. You just do a countdown of the top ten films, and you don't tell me anything about them. Or if you do, you use no more than six words. So I tell you. Uh, no. Nope. I've got it. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you if this is okay or not. Okay. Um, I tell you the name of the film and who's in it. And nothing else. Nothing else. Is that what you perfect, want? Perfect. Perfect. And what about? Do you want me to? No. Nope. I was going to ask you another question. Yeah, I know. Um, wh whatever the question is, I, I know. Well, you don't even hear it. So how can you say no? Because what I want is just the top ten, and Matt, I tell you what, the top ten, and you pick one film. Um, you don't want me to pre-review, uh, uh, like, saying one that's not in the top ten? No. You don't? Not, not well, OK, the... that, can be, that can be the one film. Just pick, do the top ten, OK, uh, and then just give me one film, wh whether it's in the top ten or it's not coming out yet, and that's it. That's all we need. And a minute and a half, bam, 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 we're there. OK, that's fine. But, Thank you. Uh, I thought I could... The way I no, thought... I'm, I'm, yes, I'm going to go now. OK, just one last thing. Oh, God. Please? Yes. Um, what about, about my idea about people phoning in and telling me if they've seen any of the films? No. Uh, sir?